Did you see the drama? Starting today's vlog on the way to the hospital. Don't you worry, nothing happened to me. I just need to do a new allergy patch test. I don't know if I've told you guys the story of my allergies before, but I actually got anaphylactic shock already once before. And prior to this incident, I never had any allergies, like zero allergies. The only major allergies I know of, or any allergies for that matter, is um, my allergies to dust so I'd always get like really really sneezy I would kind of get sick if it's too dusty but then um, I think this happened 2017 or 2018 yeah probably 2017 I came home from a work trip I think this was to Phuket and it was a late night flight I finished dinner around 10 p.m. already and then all of a sudden when I was already in my bedroom I was kind of feeling like my eyes were itchy so I thought oh maybe it's just the makeup I'll just remove my makeup and then while I was removing my makeup I could feel my eyes getting itchier and itchier and kind of getting swollen already which I've been used to this already this has happened to me before like getting swollen eyes but so I just thought that maybe like it just got irritated basically but then by the time I finished washing my eyes I was back in bed like my eyes were super swollen na. it was so so fast my nose was starting to get clogged but it wasn't the type that I could blow I would try to blow my nose but then nothing would come out and then my throat already starting to itch like not itch actually like I felt like the need to cough so then um i was rushed to the hospital which was just like five minutes away from us and by the time that we got to the hospital my eyes were swollen shut like they weren't just swollen they were swollen shut they were that swollen i couldn't see anymore because i couldn't open my eyes i was brought in in a stretcher so many things so many hands on me right away like everyone was in a panic so many shots injections and everything so basically yeah so i almost died um <laughs> because of that i did a patch test to find out like what triggered it and it showed me that i have so many allergies while in life and that night it was because of shrimp which i've been eating all my life no problems and it's not because it was like a bad set of shrimp which other people have probably experienced because sometimes when you eat like a bad set of shrimp it will mimic an allergy this was totally fresh totally good like it was really like really really good shrimp and so there i took that test and turns out out of the 60 allergens i was allergic to 41 11 of which were major this also happened in a time in my life when my immune system was so 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 bad i remember a few trips before that my aunt who's our family doctor actually was already telling me that if i were you i wouldn't push through with this trip but i couldn't not push through because it was a work trip so anyways i already knew my immune system was low and at the end of the day allergies are it's a type of autoimmune disease and so because my immune system was down i was also feeling sick that night when i got home so yeah it was just like the perfect combination it triggered everything and then i found out that i was allergic but to so many things that i've been eating fine my entire life but then apparently it's always been in my system so yeah the doctor explained to me that you know this sometimes happens you're allergic to something but it never really manifests because you haven't really reached that threshold and for me i reached the threshold for shrimp and ever since then i stayed away from all these other food items that is on my major allergy list like tuna and beef and stuff like that but now i feel brave five years after i feel brave to take the patch test again because i have a feeling that baka naman my immune system is better so maybe my allergies have magically disappeared i'm hoping i really am hoping so yeah i'm doing it again with my doctor she was the one who first tested me before also she knows my history so yeah i'm really hoping because actually just recently i accidentally ate shrimp and nothing happened to me before when that happened to me like i immediately felt the effects like i knew something was gonna happen to me my eyes started getting itchy right away i had to take antihistamine right away like it always causes me legit fear but yeah but recently i just feel like i'm stronger i'm really hoping that it magically disappeared i don't know i really miss eating all the types of food that i love Actually, even if beef is also my major allergy, I've been eating a lot of hungry homies you can see on my stories. So yeah, we're going to have a patch test. I am praying to dear God that I, I get a better result now. 
fingers crossed. So this was my old result before. Look at how many. So the ones that have like three to five bars are my major allergies. Sobrang dami niya. And then my minor allergies are the ones that have one to two bars. So I have here house dust, feathers. I remember asking Doc, Doc, paano kung ano siya? Nasa loob ng puff jacket. Kasi nilalam inside is feather. She said then, maybe that's fine. It's usually when your pores touch it or like when you sweat and then it touches it, then that gets activated. And then like, I have dust mites as well. Dust talaga, I know, because hindi ko kailangang tingnan kung madumi yung place. Anyway, we'll, we'll start. I will continue yeah, later. My chica chica. Now they're marking it. This is where I will be poked of the different allergens. Here yes. are the allergens. <laughs> <laughs> we'll just drop these one by one. These are the concentrated allergens. It's alright. This is more on foods. Light trick only. Just to break the skin. <laughs> may makate na. May makate na. Ang kate ng arms ko, my god. I wanna scratch them already. So as you've seen, nurse just put like the concentrated allergens onto my skin with some marks. And then she got like a really tiny needle to do like a really really tiny poke on all of them. And then you'll see later on kung which ones yung nag-react. Nakikita ko na sila actually. My god, so itchy. Oh my gosh. So I want to show you guys. Usually you have to wait 30 minutes but naawa na po sa akin. I see ko na yung malaki para hindi ka naman kawawa nagsasacrifice. This is the dust mite as usual. As usual. Are you a positive for a before? I'm very sure of that. Yes. And how's dust? Very sure also. I'm always allergic too. So this is how it looks guys. If you're super allergic to it, it gets really inflamed. And they also feel so itchy, but you can't scratch them. So, <laughs> so I haven't been scratching them, <laughs> but it's so itchy, my gosh. But the food side looks very promising. And that's really what I came here for, so I'm so happy. Possible din na magkaroon ka ng delayed reaction. Pero as we can see, immediate reaction. So obviously, sila yung may reaction talaga. Mm. And here, sa celery. That's the first okay lang. Ayaw ka naman may celery. Hindi siya kawalan. Hindi siya kawalan. Hindi <laughs> po kawalan ng celery. <laughs> lemon! Ang hili ko pa naman sa lemon. Sure ba yan? 3 and 4. Ulitin natin yung lemon. Four. Yeah, here the lemon. <laughs> Ayaw, obviously, ayan na. Mm -hmm. You know, very slight naman. So considered one lang. Para at least may idea ka na it might be up. Pagka naparami ang kain mo. Here, so far, sa meat, five. Slight sa tuna, super slight here. Considered ko na lang din. Oh my gosh, I can eat tuna! Yeah. And, and then, so here, the lemon. Oh my gosh, wala nang shrimp! Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me see. Oh, here, oh. Very good. It's a good sign. This is the shrimp crab oyster plants. Oh my Someone. gosh, nakakaiyak. Oh, di pa. Oh, eh, pero... so, so, meaning, <laughs> nag-improve ka sa seafood. It's a good sign. Tapos dati pati beef, wala yung yeah, beef. Yeah, oh, here, oh, wala naman. Oh my gosh. Oh, di ba, hindi siya nahawa sa pork, sa beef. Here, oh, use the beef, eh. Seafood, wala naman. Consider, you want to consider, eh, tuna, I consider tuna naman, pero not that beef. Diba? Oh, I'm so, so yun happy! Yun. <laughs> so, yun niya. Pero, syempre, if you eat, minimal lang din. Pag naman, mm -hmm. sa baka nabigla ako, isang pandiyan. Ang <laughs> order agad. Yeah. Naiiyak ako, brother Jet. Yes. I really am. Yes. Diba? So, kasi ang allergy na detailed no? So, there's a big changes kasi 2017 pa eh. Diba? Naiyak talaga ko eh. My gosh, you guys. I didn't think an allergy test could make me cry. Oh, tears of joy. My love for food is real. Diba? Magkakaroon na rin kasi ako guys. Kaya medyo hormonal, ano? Saya niya. I am so happy. So happy. These are my old results from 2017. And compared to now, 2022, I'm so happy. Yeah. So it's a brand new day. I wasn't able to vlog na after my amazing patch test yesterday because <laughs> I was in a hurry. I had an event and now I am doing an errand with my sister. I'm now an errand queen for the family. So today, my sister dragged me out because 
she claims it's to bond but really it's because she wanted to go check out JMA jewelry's sales. So we're gonna check out some jewelry now. They have a sale ongoing so we're just gonna window shop right sis? <laughs> yeah. So JMA is actually the same people who did our wedding rings and I love them to bits. They make really really nice jewelry. My earrings are actually by them. I had it custom made by them and I love it. I wear them every day. As I was saying, I wasn't able to go back to the vlog now yesterday. I was planning to go back to the vlog but, but because it took me a while to get back home from the doctors. I wasn't able to already because I was rushing because I had an event yesterday. But I'm sure a lot of you guys will be asking me where I did my allergy patch test. So I do my allergy patch test at Dr. Canlas's office. So Dr. Manuel Canlas and his daughter is my doctor. And so she was the one who treated me when I got my anaphylactic shock before. She was the one who helped me recover and everything. So she really knows my history. And so yeah, that patch test, they can do it for food for nature, also for my cosmetic ingredients and stuff like that. It depends what tests you get but for my specific tests, it's around like 7k for that test but totally worth it now that I'm free to eat all the food I want. And so yeah, very very easy. It's pain free. It's just really itchy when you get an allergic reaction to something. That's all. You're choosing between these two. So my sister is looking for a tennis bracelet. And I really love this thinner one more. It's so weird. This is the... I don't know why it is. I've always wanted to have a tennis necklace. <coughs> yoni, yoni, yoni. <laughs> yoni. <coughs> Pero kasi we're building a house, ano? So, so this is point twenty. Welcome to Trish Ison's <laughs> live selling. Yes. It's so nice, the big one. I didn't want it to be that small. Beautiful. This is a vintage Boucheron. Oh, Tish is making me sad. Giving me more and more options, <laughs> making me realize that I can't buy them. No. Nana na wagan po ko kay Yoni Koro. Mister Plum. Yoni Koro, please. You can sell no your kids. Push gift. 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 Push Look at it. Look at every day. Pang grocery. It's so nice. My gosh, it's so nice. They cleaned my rings for me. So now, they look new. Trish brought me another option. This one naman for Labada Day. Labada Day? Wait lang, kulang pa Labada mo. Ay, ito pa pala. Oh, anak, luto na tayo. Let's bake. <laughs> Casual labada day. And then we're also baking. Okay, okay. Maghugas ng pinggan. That type of thing. Oh. Where are we going? She doesn't know it yet. It's her favorite place. Where are we going, Sienna Bug? We're going to the doctors, my love. Doctors, Sienna Bug. You're gonna try again, my love. <laughs> you see the drama. She just went. Ah, 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 ah. Why? Yeah, why? That's life, my love. Everyone has to experience this. Yes? What? Okay, so we survived the doctors and it was again a crisis. 
emphasis on the cry. She immediately knew right away. Doc just said hi, and she already started crying. Nothing was happening yet, and she was already crying. But Doc says it's completely expected at this age. They're starting to become more aware, but they don't really understand yet. So then you can't explain yet. So we just have to wait until she's like over two, then she'll she'll be friends with Doc. That's our hope. So now we're just gonna do a quick grocery trip. Quick, quick, quick grocery trip, and then we're going to head home. But yeah, so now she's very, very serious with her milk. I can't see you guys because it's too sunny here at the site. We're at the site again. So we're doing weekly site visits already. Actually more than I because we're <sighs> nearing the finish line. But today we are going to check the paint swatches that we chose. And also we're going to meet with a potential landscape designer, landscape architect to check everything. And now my husband is very, very pissed at me looking at me because why am I not going in though right away? Okay, so this is the main color that we chose for majority of the areas. So it's called Sugar Dust. I really like the color. It's not so cool white. There's some warmth to it. We're just choosing which finish we're gonna go for satin or matte. I feel like you can't really tell the difference yet with the finishes because the paint is still a bit wet. So we've got majority of the glass already installed at the house. And we also already have the glass here outdoors. Super nice. I didn't even notice that our tiles here in the living room is already being installed. There's so much already. I really love it. It's our favorite tile. It's from Tile Gallery and it's super nice. It's a creamy off-white color. It's not gray actually. It's creamy. And so now we're second-guessing our chosen wall color because wall color, then it's it might be a bit too warm because we're already having a lot of wood in the area. And then if you look at it with the tile, it feels very warm and they feel kind of too similar. So maybe we have to tone down and like make it even a cooler white this time because our floor is actually already cool and Rio agrees gave us a thumbs up so yeah we need to cool it down so this is what we chose on the swatch it looks so much more yellow than the swatch So I've already chosen for more swatches that we're gonna do on the walls. Just to see, it's always like that when you're choosing paint. It's never really how it looks on the swatch itself. Because of course, the environment also affects it, the surroundings. And it's always nice to see it with a tile and imagine it already with other stuff that you're putting in the space. Because all of this will contribute to how cool or warm the paint will look overall. So yeah, we just chose like cooler tones and we'll see. Okay, so this is for Extra Kid. <laughs> this is a color accent for Extra Kid. We're going for white still for the rooms, but they all have color accents. I find it a little bit too happy, but Yoni really likes it. <laughs> I like it. I think it's a nice pop of color there. I wanted something a bit like duller. No. But he likes it. Yeah, because then it goes dark if you go duller. It becomes more of not kitty color, it becomes like a, this trendy. Yeah, but if you make it kiddie kase, then you for sure have to change it when they're older. Sure, we have to change it seven times during their lifetime anyway, so. And this is for Sienabog. Don't mind this white area. We're gonna change it also. I think it's too warm. And then uh, this color is her accent color. She actually chose this from all the swatches that I pre selected, and I really, really like it.
showing you guys our laundry room. I'm really so excited for our laundry room. So Ideal Home already came here and they've already noted like where to put the faucet, the washer, like the shelves and everything here, adjustable shelves. This is our drying area and then on the opposite wall, it'll be full of cabinets for like clothes that they washed, supplies and stuff like that. I'm so excited for this room. So mommy bought you this. These are sticker albums, sticker collection books. Which one do we open first? Only one. Bum Bum chooses for you. Which one? This one or this one? Have to choose one. Okay, mommy opens this first, the green one, okay? You have to sit here, have to sit. Okay, so this is our sticker book, right? So then, Sienna Bog and mommy will put stickers. But Nai Nai bought us. Look at all the stickers Nai Nai bought. Which one does mommy open? Cannot open everything. So which one? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Have to tell mommy which one. Mm -mm. This one? Huh? What? Yes? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Terrible has chosen the flowers. Flower. Flower. Okay. So then what you do is like this, my love. You get it. Mommy gets one. Mm -hmm. And then mommy gets the flower and put it here. Mm -hmm. Here. Put here. There. Whoa. Okay. Your turn, Terrible. And then put here. Wow! Look, Sienna Bog. Mommy removes. It's a heart. See? My love, it's not a mosquito patch. You have to put here. Like this. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, ay, ay. Ta da! It's so cute, ah! Oh. Wow! You like stickers. I figured out that Sienna might like stickers because she loves her mosquito patches. She loves playing with the mosquito patches. So here we are. Yeah. Oh, you're putting it back? <gasps> no need to put back. We can just put here and then look at the book. You can put also here in this other page. See? No, no. Ah, no? Okay. Mm? No. The process is a bit reversed. She's removing it from the sticker album. Rayel? No color. This is your sticker book. See? Rayel? And then we put also your heart heart here. Rayel? 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 Here? Cannot color, my love. It's a different ano, paper. See? Cannot color here. I just need a sketch pad. Ooh, the sticker album Mama bought is now a sketch pad. Kids really always have their own plans. Ta-da! Our artwork. Oh, show, show everyone our artwork. Show, show camera. Yay! Like this here. Yay! Wow, wow, wow. wow yeah. Wow, wow. Ball. It's palo and finish, so that's what she's saying. Uh-uh. Okay, thank you, Ella. Oh, okay. Bye! Okay, keep, keep, keep. Very good, keep. Have to say isa. Isa. Dalawa. Dalawa. Tatlo. Tatlo. Apat. Apat. Lima. Apat. Anim. Anim. Pito. Pito. Walo. Walo. Siyam. Sampu. Uh -uh. Okay, have to count first. Open, 
also. You can open later, my love. Later, mommy, open. What's there? Oh, milk! I have to say goodnight to mommy first. Okay. I have to say goodnight to dada. Dada's in the room. vlog this week. I'm gonna see you guys next week. I have more non-day in the life content but let me know if you guys enjoy this. It's just a chill way for me to vlog. I don't know if you guys noticed but I've lessened the number of vlogs that I've been doing recently because I'm feeling some sort of way about this so that is why I've decided to take a break take a little break for a while so I really really do hope that you guys like this even though it's you know for me it's just my usual regular programming but I hope you guys don't find it boring anyway give me some love let me know what you think on the comment section below and I'll see you guys next week